My name is Melanie Vaughn, and I'd like to um, take this opportunity to tell you a few stories. The one I'd like to do today is Pele's New Suit. It's a story about a Swedish little boy and he and his little lamb. There was once a little Swedish boy whose name was Pele. Now Pele had a lamb which was all his own and which he took care of all himself. The lamb grew and Pele grew and the lamb's wool grew longer and longer but Pele's coat grew shorter. One day Pele took a pair of shears and cut off all the lamb's wool. Then he took the wool to his grandmother and said, Granny dear, please card this wool for me. That I will, my dear, said his grandmother, if you will pull the weeds from my carrot patch for me. So Pele pulled the weeds in his granny's carrot patch and granny uh, carded Pele's wool. And there, and there he is out in the garden, and there she is in the house, straightening all the wool fibers. Then Pele went to his other grandmother and said, Grandmother dear, please spin this wool into yarn for me. That I will gladly do, my dear, said his grandmother, if while I am spinning it, you will tend to my cows for me. And so Pele tended his grandmother's cows, and grandmother spun Pele's yarn. And there he is outside with the cows. And here's his grandmother inside spinning. Then Pele went to the neighbor, who was a painter, and asked him for some paint with which to color his yarn. What a silly little boy you are, laughed the painter. My paint is not what you want to color your wool, but if you row over to the store and get a bottle of turpentine for me, you may buy yourself some dye out of the change from the shilling. And there's the painter. So Pele rolled, rowed over to the store and bought a bottle of turpentine for the painter and bought for himself a large sack of blue dye out of the change from the shilling. And there he is rowing across. And there he is in the shop, buying the turpentine and some dye. Then he dyed his wool himself until it was all blue. And then Pele went to his mother and said, Mother dear, please weave this yarn into cloth for me. That I will gladly do, said his mother, if you will take care of your little sister for me. So Pele took good care of his little sister, and his mother wove the wool into cloth. And there he is, taking care of his sister. So what do you see that he's done? He wants something, and he, he asks, and then somebody else needs something, and he can provide that. So he's getting help along the way. Then Pele went to the tailor. Dear Mr. Tailor, please make a suit for me out of this cloth. Is that what you want, you little rascal, said the tailor? Indeed I will, if you will rake my hay and bring it and bring in my wood and feed my pigs for me. Well that's a pretty expensive job if you have to do all that. And it takes a lot of time too, and the tailor has to get ready for winter. So Pele raked the tailor's hay and fed his pigs. And then he carried in all the wood, and the tailor had Pele's suit ready that very Saturday evening.
And on Sunday morning, Pele put on his new suit and went to his lamb and said, Thank you very much for my new suit, little lamb. Bah, said the lamb, and it sounded almost as if the lamb were laughing. There, there he is with his little lamb, getting ready to go to church. Thank you.